This is O B G Y N, and today we're gonna talk about what's a presentation and what's an engaging diameter. If I give you a presentation of the fetus in the uterus, and you have to tell me the engaging diameter, engaging diameter, okay? So let's talk this a kind of a revision for you for your USMLE or for medical school examination guys. So just try to concentrate on this. Okay, if I tell you the presentation is a face, what's the engaging diameter over here? Look, there are two possibilities. If there's a partially extended head, then it's a submento vertical. Submento vertical. Okay and if it's what you call in a fully extended head it is gonna be sub mento pragmatic sub mento pragmatic okay right guys then we have if the presentation is occipito posterior if the presentation is occipito posterior Tell me what will be the engaging diameter. If the head is deflexed, it's gonna be what you call suboccipital frontal. Suboccipital frontal. And if the what you call uh, deflexed, if the deflexed head is further deflexed, means more deflection of the head, then the presenting the engaging diameter will be occipital frontal. Occipito frontal okay then we have bro presentation if the presentation is a bro bro presentation what will be the engaging diameter is a mental vertical MV mental vertical mental vertical okay guys really very important okay if there is what you call a breach presentation breach Okay, breach in the what you call breach presentation is gonna be bitrochantric bitrochantric okay and if it's a breach presentation if it's a shoulder one okay if it's a shoulder then the presenting the engaging diameter will be what you call base acromial base acromial okay and if it's head then it's gonna be sub occipital frontal okay that we see in occipital posterior same thing right so thank you so much for watching this video guys take care